good Wednesday morning. We are just getting home from taking, excuse me, from taking Jacob to um, school. And we ran by the library. I took my camera, but I forgot my memory card. So that did not help me at all. So we just took Jake to school and we ran by the library. We needed to recheck out our farmer boy book and we picked up a few extras. And now we are having some oatmeal and toast. And we are gonna jump on all of our schoolwork That's real quick and get that out of the way for the day. Is it really good? Yes. So we're gonna get our schoolwork out of the way for the day, eat some breakfast, and have some reading time, and just kinda hang out a little bit. I have a doctor's appointment today, so I've got to do that. Wah, wah. So disappointing, I hate appointments. What? I hate a too. I just, I don't like doing it. I just like to be at home on my days off. And I don't like a whole lot of running around. So whenever I have to do something like a doctor's appointment that must be done, it's kind of a bummer. Yes, I hate shots. Shots? Yeah. They... And, I, and I hate fingerprints. Me too. Hopefully I don't have to have that done today. But I have to make sure that my thyroid levels are all in check, which I'm sure they're not because I was out of my medicine for a little bit. Mom. But anyway, so I'm going to eat some oatmeal. And I'm going to put a roast in the crock pot for dinner and homeschool and get on with our day. All right, you guys. So today's dinner is going to be a Mississippi pot roast. And to be honest, I have never made a Mississippi pot roast before, but I am really excited to give it a try. Um, I've seen Kimmy. I think she does a similar recipe. Uh, we use the, what are they called? Pepperoncini or pepper, what are they called? Peppercini or pepper, I don't know how they, what they're called, but they're like little peppers. It's a Mississippi pot roast, nonetheless. Uh, let's see. I don't even know that I've ever used the, oh, there they are, is that them? Yes. Yeah, pepper and, pepper Mommy, and sini. Where's my homework? Something like that. Huh? Okay, we'll have to look for it. I think it's in your room beside your dresser. All right, so I'm going to use a stick of salted butter, the peppers, the ranch seasoning mix, and onion seasoning mix. Let's see if I can find all that in here somewhere. Here's my ranch. Where's the onion? onion soup packet. That's what I'm talking about. some bread in the bread machine. I'm doing our tried and true egg bread recipe. There's a passy. Um, that's what it looks like. It's really good. We love to have that kind of bread with dinner. I've got the roast in the crock pot. I got a baby mander. We call him mander. Baby mander. Hey baby mander. <laughs> hey silly boy. Mason's working on spelling. Um, are you done? Yeah. Let's go check it out. So, I just got the baby to sleep. He's upstairs. Um, we did spelling. Mason is almost through with his math. And so I'm going to help him finish his math. And then we are going to do our reading lesson and read alouds. And the house is starting to smell really good with that 
roast in the crock pot. All right, you guys, so we are just about done with our homeschooling. We have a little Mommy. bit left, but I have a doctor's appointment Mama. today. Yeah, I can fix this thing. I will fix it for you. Um, so Gavin and I are having fruit smoothies for lunch. The kids are having peanut butter and jelly and some chips. And um, then me and the little ones are getting ready to run to the doctor's office. Me and this little guy and Maddie. And then I think um, Gavin's gonna stay here with Mason. So, and then my friend is bringing Jacob home from school. So that's what we're getting ready to do. We're just gonna bite the bullet yeah. and go do the thing I don't wanna do, which is go to the doctor's and Mom. check on my thyroid and all that. So Maddie Solomon and I are on our way to the doctor's office. He has been screaming today. Um, I think it's his, it's definitely his teeth. We're having issues with his little teeth, bless his heart. So, um, I had to change clothes because he spit up all over me. <laughs> it's like never fails the second you're walking out the door. It's like, <laughs> so I'm all cleaned up and we are almost there. Really hope this appointment goes very quickly. And then we will be headed back home. I brought a book to read. I, um, I picked this book up at the library this morning. It is, what's it called? Celebration of Discipline, The Path to Spiritual Growth. So we're gonna, I'm gonna check it out, see how it is. I kind of like browse through a little bit of it and it looks pretty interesting. So I think it's a pretty old book. So I'm gonna read that hopefully. And um, I just finished, you guys, I'm so addicted to um, Audible. I love it. I have read or listened to like four or five books this month. Um, audiobooks so because of the fact that I have a pretty long drive to work I am really just moving through these books super fast so tell me does it count as reading a book if you're listening to it what do you guys think can I can I say I have read the like four books this month or do I does that not really count I don't know what do you guys think because it's not exactly reading but, I mean, it should count, right? I think it should count as reading. So, that's four books down. It was, I did um, Present Over Perfect. I did um, Teaching From Rest. I did Anxious For Nothing by Max Lucado. And I just recently finished um, the what was it called? It's A.W. Tozer's The Dangers of a Shallow Faith, I believe it's called. Um, and it was really good. So, I'm desperate to start another one, but you guys, you know, they're not free. <laughs> so, you get like one, you know, credit a month or whatever. So, I think I get a new one on the 6th. So, in two days, I should have a credit. And I'm like really antsy to start a new book. But until then, library book it is, and I'll actually have to read this one somehow. Well, that was pretty painless. <laughs> it was a pretty pretty good visit. Um, had some blood drawn, and I have to go in another month to have more lab work done. But apart from that, not bad, not bad. I'm such a baby. I hate going to the doctor, you guys. <laughs> such a baby. But anyway that's over with I just honestly it's not that I like don't like the doctors I just I just don't like taking the time to do it do you know what I'm saying I always feel like I have so much going on that I'm like oh what an inconvenience I just hate doing that kind of stuff but enough of my whining um I'm interested to see how our roast is turning out and I just realized today is Wednesday so um I'd love to go to church today, but I don't know if Jimmy's gonna be off of work in time to go, so that's kind of a bummer. Um, I may just take the kids myself and go, I'm not sure. Um, Mason is dying to go to the park, so we need to probably try and make some time to do that. So we just got home and the roast is smelling so good and the bread is done in the bread machine. You guys, the house smells heavenly. So here's the bread. Looking, oh, almost dropped the camera. Looking so wonderful. And then here is the roast. Yummy. 
It's got a while, I think. But I'm going to go ahead and um, do some roasted sweet potatoes. I want to have our entire dinner like done really early so that I can kind of take it easy tonight and relax and read and spend some time just hanging out instead of working. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and finish dinner and then I might do the read alouds with the kids and do some editing and my load of laundry for the day. <laughs> it is time for a walk. Got a big man in the stroller. Big man. Hey, big man. <laughs> you ready to go for a walk? Look at those big guys.